Hello and welcome to my office, which is actually currently more of a shipping center for my new book. So let's just start with a big thank you to those of you who have already ordered the life back from my store. You order from my store, it does arrive personally autographed. You can easily find my store on the clickable link below this video update. So every night before I go to bed, I reset this all up with this, this stack right here, right? And so every day I've been able to completely go through these stacks. So I have the paperback version of my new book. I have the hard copy version of my new book and a lot of buyers are still going out there and getting caught up on the first story. So I thought I'd give you a little breakdown of what these books are about. My first book was released December of 2015 and it's called The Life because it really does give you a breakdown of the life. What it was like for me um, going to school and, and getting into the industry and the journey of the industry. There's a great chapter about what it was like to play the role in Who's Nailin' Palin as Sarah Palin. This book really ends at my retirement in 2015. So this book gives you a kind of general story of the life. And when I started to sit down and think about writing another book, I knew the journey would be what it was like, you know, to be out of the industry and to be doing other things, but it became so much more because at the release of this book was a very, very turbulent time in my life. I went through really the most change, uh, the most forced change that I've ever had to face or would ever consider myself having to face. And when I sat down to put together my new book, The Life Back, I realized that there were a lot of missing links in the life that I didn't really share because whether it was I wasn't ready, um, I wasn't in that place of truly understanding, I hadn't yet fully connected the dots. And the life was so fun to write because there were so many fun stories going to Finland as Sarah Palin, traveling the world, doing trade shows. There was my first scene, my first movie. Like there were so many things. Like the, the, as you can see, when you compare the two, there was a lot of story to be told here. I became a bit of a better writer from being a bigger reader here. But this is going to give you a better understanding of me. The first book gave you the understanding of the life, what it was like to be in the industry, um, what it was like to get in the industry when I first started before the internet, when I couldn't just upload photos to people and I had to hire photographers in Pennsylvania, have those photos developed and then mail them to the companies in California. It was a two year process of me working to getting into the industry. So that was all very fascinating. And then I get down to this. This starts out with a heart pumping story about an experience that I had that will just really suck you in. My friends have been able to do the cover to cover read, which is what the goal was for this book, The Life Back, to be about a four hour read if you're a fast reader and also a book that you truly don't wanna put down. So here I am excited to share with you the truths that I left out of my first book, The Life, obviously wasn't there, wasn't ready, didn't understand myself like I understand now. And then the journey of where I am today. It ends when I arrived in New York City and I'll read you that last passage right here. I plan to do some YouTube lives um, to really talk to my readers so here I was, and this is the very last passage. The flight from California to New York felt different. I had made that flight so many times, but this time it was emotional. I loved California, but I reminded myself that the state had already served its purpose as I had no doubts of the unlimited potential I was about to stumble on in New York City. As I was in the elevator of my new apartment building in the city with my keys dangling from my fingers, it finally hit me big time. I was like, oh shit, you just did all of that. You sold your house, you packed your shit and moved. It was a powerful solo moment. My key went in, I opened the door to see my empty two bedroom apartment that could easily fit in my previous master bedroom. I took a deep breath. I felt a warm rush of excitement. The simplification of my life would only allow me more time to live. Here I was ready to live my best life after the life. 
I think you're going to really enjoy this one. You can get it from my store. Just go to shoplisaann.com. It's going to drop you down in my bookstore. You're going to go into catalog and you're going to find both of my books right there. Thank you all for subscribing to my YouTube page. I appreciate all of you. Share these videos, my podcast, and everything that I add on here with your friends. Like, subscribe, all the goodness. Appreciate all of you. And I hope to hear your feedback on a YouTube live on the release of my new book, The Life Back.